Good morning. It is Monday morning, May 20th, 2024. Uh, we had steady sales through the weekend. A little on the low side, but can't complain too much. Uh, Friday was 255. Saturday 269. Sunday 229. So the summer slowdown seems to have started a little bit. First order going out. One person bought three vintage BMW motorcycle advertisements. Paid six dollars each for those, plus a total of $7.93 shipping. Next is a book 101. Harley Davidson Twin Cam Performance Projects, $9.95 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a 1975 Street Bike Magazine, $12.78 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a record, The McLaughlin's On the Way Home, $20.21 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a Caller ID Box. Sold for $9.82 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a crate label from the 1920s. Iceberg lettuce. These are the uh, labels that came on the wooden crates when they were out picking fruit and vegetables out in the fields. Lion. Uh, let's see, $14.53 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a... Honda Motorcycle Factory Service Manual for the VTX models. This sold for $44.95 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a cassette tape, Charles Johnson and the Revivers. Going on with Jesus, $15 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a vintage guitar advertisement, 1976 Ovation Matrix. $10.63, $5.95 shipping. Next is a 78 RPM record, 1943 Glenn Miller, Rhapsody in Blue, $7 plus $7.95 shipping. Next is a record, the Good News Trio, One of God's Sheep, $20.97 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a record from 1961, Van Cliburn, Chicago Symphony Orchestra, Walter Hendel conducting. Anyway, $5.52 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a record from 1972, The Inspirations, We Shall Rise, $6.13 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is another record. 1969, Perry Como, The Lord's Prayer. Still got the uh, old price sticker on there. I don't know if that's Kmart or what. It doesn't say. But, uh, yeah, 1969. The year I was born. And this is in great condition, too. But it only sold for $6.13 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a record box set, three LPs, Hayden, uh, the Amadeus Quartet, 1979, $18.71 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is another record. This is from 1969, Joplin, Missouri, Ozark Bible College Choir, The Lord is Risen, $19.97 plus $5.95 shipping. Next, one person bought three vintage advertisements and articles having to do with motorcycling in Atlanta. Uh, these three sold for a total of $33.56 plus $7.93 shipping. Next, we have a 1975 Motorcycle World magazine, $14.05 plus $5.95 shipping. Next, we have another record, the Brother... Joe May story going on a long journey after a while. After a while. That's two LPs here. And this sold for $19.95 plus $5.95 shipping. 
Next, a Cycle Magazine from 1985. $11.87 plus $5.95 shipping. Next, we have another record. Uh, 1973, out of Cocoa Beach, Florida High School. Symphonic Chorale. $27.97 plus $5.95 shipping. Next, from 1965, a record. Herb Alpert's Tijuana Brass Whipped Cream and Other Delights. $8.76 plus $5.95 shipping. Next is a 1978 Steve Miller Band Songbook. $20.97 plus $5.95 shipping. Next, a vintage motorcycle advertisement from 1959, the Norton Jubilee 250. $12.57, $5.95 shipping. Next is a 1997 Cycle News magazine, newspaper. Uh, $14.38, plus $5.95 shipping. Next is this big old candle holder. Made out of metal of some sort. 16 inches tall. I think I lost money on this thing because... I've had it forever. Finally took an offer, $6.97 plus $9.93 shipping. It does unscrew into four pieces so I can get into a decent sized box. So hopefully I don't lose too much money on this one. But yeah, that one's not a great sale. Next is a record, 1971 Hopper Brothers and Connie, $6.00. 13 cents plus 5.95 shipping. Next is a record, That Strange Mr. Poe by Thomas Kleiss. Uh, it's about Edgar Allan Poe. It's $15, 5.95 shipping. Next is a 10 inch 78 RPM record. It's a white label promo record. It's not shellac, it's actually vinyl, very razor thin vinyl. It's uh, Perez Prado. Cuban Mambo. Uh, sold for 1995 plus 595 shipping. No, actually, what did I did I get 795 for this one? Let's see. Yeah, 795 shipping. Next we have a 7-inch 45 RPM record. It's a white label promo. Patty Smith isn't it enough. Four dollars twenty nine cents plus five ninety five. Next, we have a very strange record uh, from 1970, 1970, Sentimental Journey, John Lewis Kell and Flory Parrish. Uh, this sold for forty five dollars plus five ninety five shipping. Next, we have a record from nineteen eighty six, Petra, Back to the Street. And this is a uh, promotional copy. It's embossed back here on the back. Promo copy, not for sale. That's a third promo copy record I've sold today. I'm sensing a trend here. I just listed this one yesterday too. Uh, $17.97 plus $5.95 shipping. Last item going out right now. 1979 January Cycle Magazine. $8.00. 31 cents plus 5.95 shipping. You all have a great Monday. I'll see you next time. Roger over and out.